We're giving Ryan a tasty send off by having some of our favorite chefs prepare some of Ryan's favorite dishes. Mm. And we're going to get him to break his fasting window all week. Obligated. We all know that Ryan is fond of fondue. <laughs> uh, the humor. So here to show it, it shoots itself. Here to show us how it's done is world famous chef, my cousin from the restaurant Le Bernardin, Eric, Chef Eric Repair. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you for chef, being here. It's so good to see you. It's great to see you too. You are our favorite. All right, I'm we're so making happy we're doing cheese fondue. Cheese for you fondue. Today. So am yes. I. Okay. And today's cheese fondue day on top of it. Yes. Oh. It's what a coincidence. Fondue. Yes, what a coincidence. Good planning uh, somewhere. All right, so what do we start you with? are going to grate some cheese. Different cheese. And different. We have um, Emmental and Gruyere mm. and uh, this one, which is from Tina. And. <laughs> oh. Um, Smells yes. like cheese. And you are going to cut some vegetables that oh, we sure. will use at the end. Um, I have the, the pan here. I use a bit of garlic that okay. I rub. You uh -huh. always, it's a tradition. You rub the, the pan with a bit of garlic like that, and you remove it. Yes. So ah. that it you gives a little good. je ne sais quoi. Je, je ne sais, sais quoi. quoi. <laughs> but, oui, um, mon ami. <laughs> and then I'm going to put some white wine. Mm. It has to be hot, so it's good. Mm. Um, Mm -hmm. Are you good with the grating of the cheese? Yeah, yes. You can use a knife to cut it if you wish as well. Mm -hmm. or, um, I'm going to put a, a bit of heat here. I think we're good. Okay, Kelly, you're going to mix a bit of lemon juice with cornstarch. With cornstarch. Uh, now here? that? Uh, together? Yeah, does, yeah, we together. make this, but we don't use the lemon juice. What does that do? So the lemon juice and the, and the cornstarch are going to um, create a reaction with the cheese and the white wine. Okay. Because um, the cheese and the white wine will be kind of like not really together okay. and it will give a very nice silky texture. Okay. So I'm going to put some cheese here and start to oh. melt it mm. like that. It smells so good no that idea. I feel bad You're... for you at home. <sighs> I really, Your cold is, is how does that look? Yeah, Lower? it looks really good. Um, okay. Next um, cheese? Are these yes. different cheeses? So we have three different cheeses. You can, you can use, I mean, really any kind of cheese you like, but... Emmental, Swiss Emmental cheese, is great, yeah. Fontina is very nice. Mm -hmm. And you see that it doesn't come together like that. Mm -hmm. it's, it's kind of like, how you call it, clunky? Mm. Clunky. Clunky, okay. Uh, uh, je ne sais quoi clunk. You see like that? So do you want not me yet, to... Not yet, not yet. Oh! He's a three-star Michelin chef. I'll okay, just let me keep add doing the this. last one. <laughs> <laughs> what are you doing? Uh, I Kevin? don't know, I'm making ah, a science experiment. No, we're good. So we have, we have the vegetables. We have the cheese melting in that white wine. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Now you're going to be able to uh, add it slowly in it. Slowly. slowly. Is this enough? Did I do it right? Or did I put the whole thing? It's oh, good no, enough for TV. Okay. It was, it was measured, especially, yes. Oh, <laughs> Precision. OK. We're going to make it. It's fine. Don't worry. And well, I'm, I'm putting scared some, to death. I don't know if I am at max here, but it's going to work. Okay. It, go ahead. Let's Go ahead and pour it in. You keep yes. stirring. The aroma is amazing. The silky oh, texture can see, is you coming. Can, you see, like now it's going to bring it together. You're going to have a different texture. And do Go you, ahead. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Do you add any pepper or anything to it? We're going to add it at the very end. Okay. Why is like Gelman that? laughing in the corner? <laughs> <laughs> so we let it melt a little bit more. Yes. Mm -hmm. And then it's ready to be uh, um, tested, right? Okay. Yes. So we're going to move. I'm going to put it here so it doesn't... We need yeah. different vessels. We have, we have this one. Okay. Oh, look at that vessel. So oh, now, yeah. I'm going to put a little bit of... Um, nutmeg? A bit of a great nutmeg mm -hmm. in it, like mm -hmm. that. A bit of cracked paper. This is a and Swiss then and French you tradition. you choose your weapon. Oh, yes. Merci. This is the best part. What happens if you lose something? So if you lose something... Because you have to keep it in there. If you lose it, yes. you have to lose a bet, don't you? Have, you have you? bread and potatoes oh. and I'm fruit. a purist. I like... So you see it? You, oh. So you go with the bread. You know, if you lose, if you lose it in it, you oh. have a penalty. Oh. It's a tradition. Okay. What do you uh, have penalty. to do? So the penalty depends on... You know... What is your penalty? People, Tell us at home. You have to smoke well, a cigarette. Some <laughs> Run into the snow no, naked. But sometimes... <laughs> well, you're close to that, because very often in, in the French Alps, so in, oh, around yeah. midnight, you see people rolling oh. in the snow in, in bathing suit. Mm. Um, and... Uh, Wow. You do so much you didn't lose it. That's it's good. Incredible. So now I have the pressure is on me. You do so much you work. You should leave the show every day. I don't know. <laughs> In the like kitchen. The next and, three and, months. And you see the lemon juice. You don't mm. test it. It just brought everything mm. together. And, and oh, here it's, oh, it's so good. Yes, mm. it's good. Uh, and by the way, thank you for all you do for City Harvest as well. Mm. I know mm. you've been working with them for so many years. Yes. How many? How 
How many pounds of food are there? Pounds of food. Oh my God. City Harvest, 40 years, 1 billion pounds of food distributed wow. in New York. That's extraordinary. Yeah, wow. it's amazing. And we are um, celebrating uh, City Harvest and we have a fundraising event, a gala, on April 25 at Cipriani. It's mm. the 40th anniversary? For the anniversary of City Harvest. Okay, yeah. we're going to put all of that information on our website if you want to make a donation to City Harvest. It's a really worthy organization. And I have yes, a feeling we're going to see you soon. <laughs> I hope so. I hope so too. <laughs> uh, Chef Eric Repin. Thank you very much. Thank, Thank you very much. We'll be right back. If you would like to try any of this week's favorite recipes, just log on to our website at kellyandryan.com.